live from downtown Westport, Connecticut. Connecticut. US 1 Post Road, Post Road, known as US 1 to the rest of us on the eastern coast, the eastern shoreline of the Atlantic coast of the United States of America in North America. How you doing? Hump day. Happy Wednesday, my friends. Check it out. Check it out. In Westport, Connecticut, beautiful place. They still concurrently doing work. I was doing food delivery through this place last night, but I've been able to see it the past two, three weeks in and out. I saw some Jeeps, Jeep lights. I see some really cool Jeeps. Give me some ideas for some Jeep. Just waiting for a safe chance to talk. We're doing a crosswalk, so I'm going to walk down this way to the crosswalk. Shout out to the Jeeps. I want y'all to see, feel, taste, explore Connecticut with me, coastal Connecticut. Beautiful place. People out and about. Single people, married people, families, friends groups, cousins. I've met them and reacted with them all this morning. <laughs> and throughout my experience here, doing delivery work. I'm online right now for Uber Eats, so y'all pardon me if y'all see me flip the screen to go do that or you hear an alarm go off. Sounds like a bell. Shout out to the Mercedes Benz S Class. Clean. Shout out to Bank of America BOA. But you can see the retailers coming through here. The retailers coming through here. So when you look at your downtown, no matter where you live, where you're from, be mindful. It can become anything. Because if you see what I'm seeing, this is a regular downtown. But it's got the retailers of a shopping center in a regular downtown. And that's something I want y'all to see. It's very beautiful experiencing with me. I just had a delivery to Campo Beach. I was going to uh, stop, parlay, take some pictures for you. But right about now, the daily parking rate is $45. That's right. It shows how to keep it so clean and beautiful. Not complaining. Just let me know a new bar to set, a new goal to set, so I can make that happen. Now, that is the crosswalk that I just crossed. Where this young lady in the blue is. Where these two young ladies are. As described, like I said. Single people, friends, groups, cousins, all that. People just hanging out. You can do Westport alone. You can do Westport in the group. Shout out to the Yukon that sell the Nolly. That's my type. That's my type. In case you don't know, I like cars, trucks, and SUVs. I like those things. Yeah, more views, more views. So we get a chance to walk now. That's Port Connecticut. Show you the view behind me. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Now, all right, I gotta get across this road. Get across this road. Who's my one viewer? I got real boy, real fat boy fishing. What up, classmate? Y'all follow his channel, follow his channel on the Instagram, on the YouTube, Real Fat Boy Fishing. So I gotta get back where I came from. This is part of it, Westport, Connecticut, downtown. I want y'all to see it with me, check it out. How you doing? Good. Doing good. Where those American flags are, that was up for Memorial Day. It was up for Memorial Day. It's live here on the weekends, y'all. It was live that weekend. But I'm headed back to where I parked. Just want y'all to get some scenery with me. Some scenery and some greenery. Check that out. Be mindful, y'all. When you're looking at your downtown, this could be your downtown. Remember Jay-Z? The story of OJ? When he could have bought he could have bought the building in Dumbo. Which is downtown Brooklyn. I'm not from there. You just get hit the game in life. Yours could be downtown Fort Pierce. Yours could be downtown Vero Beach. Could be downtown Hattiesburg, Mississippi. You just never know. Could be downtown Gulfport. Could be downtown Biloxi. You just never know. I feel like Hey, Blackboard Boxes. People are so cool, y'all. Connecticut. Jay of Rhode Island. Hey, my friend. 
Come to Gillette Stadium tonight. What's going on, Gillette Stadium tonight, classmate? What's happening? They got going over the, over there. They got a party with the Patriots. They got going on. They got going on. Sean Franklin three five four. What's up? What's happening? What's happening? I was just at the Man of Toast. I had to deliver from the Man of Toast. I might pop back in. They nice. They can stand to have me. Hi y'all. What's happening? Man of Toast. Hey. Nice people. I like them. The man. I was just at the Man of Toast on my last pickup. I had one. I had one earlier. You see Zack Snyder Justice League. Interesting. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, read, read my comments. I'll be glad today I figure out how to put the comments there so y'all can read what I see. But I had one earlier from the Freshy, which is kind of around the block. Downtown Westport is very interesting. Very interesting. So shout out to my classmates from Northeastern. Shout out to my classmates from the University of Southern Mississippi. Shout out to my classmates from Port St. Lucie High School. Shout out to my classmates from Dan McCarty Middle School. I got current ones on this live watching right now. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all up in here. More greenery on the scenery. Check out the real estate here, y'all. See how the buildings and homes and offices are. So whenever you see a situation like this, y'all, where a place of business looks like a house, they call it grandfathered in. It comes to zone. So as we come up in life, we want to buy real estate, buy property, be a part of business. Just be mindful that you can visit a city and get inspired and see how they do their thing. You might be able to bring it back to your city. If you're a student prospectively and you have certain things in mind, they have whole degree programs for it at many levels. You, know? you see they still advertising, letting you know space is available, retail spaces are available and all of that. And this happened to be a two hour parking, did not have to pay, which is cool. That's what's cool about sometimes cities away from the city. See how green it is? I'm in Connecticut. You've seen me show sunshine and skyline like this in Florida. It's beautiful, y'all. I've seen it like this in New Jersey, the northeast corner of New Jersey. Seen it in New York. Y'all see me parts of New York that I shared this kind of skyline. I'm leaning on my Jeep. She need a bath, though. <laughs> Find me a car detailer. That's why I hustle so hard, y'all. Hustle so hard. Give me a detail in there. So I can blend in around here. Remember on the cover, brother? So I can blend in around here. Keep it clean. But it's nice, y'all. And I feel, I feel my own acceptance. I create my own acceptance. I feel I belong. I want y'all to know something. Reaching deep in that bag for you. I set my life up a long time ago in mentality by training my books by Dr. Ivy Hilliard and listening to his messages. I go places royal folk go and feel I fit in because he said I fit in. And there's a lot of chitter chatter that go on in this world. I know I fit in. People may say, oh, he looks uncomfortable. He acts uncomfortable. That's a minimal voice. That's one out of 80. <laughs> but I want to let you know wherever you're from, however you grew up, whatever economic, socioeconomic part of people's description that you fit in, go experience life, go enjoy it. There's places that are welcoming to you, places where you can go taste something that you probably should nourish your body with, places you can inspire. Man, I like to have a retail building like that. I like to put a business in a retail building like that. Whichever angle you see it from, you can meet people. You can meet people. Whatever that may be, friend, a potential spouse, you can meet people. I'm gonna inspire you to get out and about. And if you're interested in the work that I do, link in the description of the video. There's money to be made. You come to a zip code, an area like this, it's hot. I went to McDonald's back to back. I've been down in this zone right here 
with avocado toast places and smoothie places and salad places. I've been in this zone in the past two hours. Multiple deliveries. And the people tip. They tip, y'all. And I keep it circulating. I tip back. I tip back, y'all. And yes, I do give alms. As Bill Winston told a joke that he probably heard from his generation, Pastor Bill Winston, the man asked for alms and he got legs. You understand what I'm saying? Don't let a dollar control your mind. Any denomination of it, one, five, 10, 20, 50, 100. Because guess what, guys? They keep printing it. It's already printed. You go learn how to get your capture of it. I endeavor to show you how to get your capture of it. That's why I make these videos. I want to show you some beautiful scenery, but I want to plug you in. I'm not all the way where I want to be, but guess what? I'll never arrive anyway. There's so many things I want to do in this life. I'm not too young, I'm not too young, I'm not too old. So I want to encourage you to be bold. Signing off, my loves. Peace. God bless.